Neurodiversity is all about learning about different people and the way that they behave. Uh, this can be either in the workplace or at home. And uh, it's a fascinating subject and we've had four days, but uh, it's a brilliant start. Do you find it easy to do something you had? No, I have a problem with that. I'd rather write it down on a piece of paper. Um, do you use a calculator? Calculator, yeah. So we wouldn't try and do it. Okay. So what about when you when you're shopping or something? Do you, you don't bother with change. You just hand over five or something. Yeah. Um, <laughs> well, yeah. It's um, you know you you don't calculate how much your shopping is going to be in your head. Right. You and when you get to the till and it comes to four pound seventy, you wouldn't count out four pound seventy. You'd hand over five and just take. Take the change. Yeah, yeah we will. We tend to use credit cards. Uh, yeah, we've really enjoyed ourselves. Um, it's gr great to get the message out to uh, us initially, and then obviously to cascade it down to our staff members and everybody about the HDQ program and uh, what it means. Uh, right, again, problems with mobility? No. no. Apart from my clumsiness. Okay, so that's right. Okay. Do you, do you put anything into uh, try and help you with that clumsiness? Do you try and sort of uh, tackle it. No, it's because no. I, I just. You don't know when it's coming. No, it just happens. Okay. Uh, eyesight. Any problems with eyesight? Just glasses. Just glasses. Yes. Oh, reading glasses or? No, no I read them all the time. All the time. We've yeah. also been doing a lot of assessments as well. So something when we get back to the workplace, we'll be doing assessments for all our employees. And the message is that you know we want to introduce this, introduce this back into the workplace, so that. Uh, our staff and our members are protected.